You understand the psyche, literally the psychology behind someone who criticizes all the time, you'll learn very quickly to be like, oh God, that's their stuff. And I'm not even going to get offended or triggered by it. So let's talk about those five things. Number one's easy and that's narcissism, right? It's always from their perspective and their perspective only. And by the way, people can have one or five of all these things or a mixed match of in between. Number two is power and control. When people criticize, they're trying to control and try to in dominate, like dominate you to make that change, right? So we know that that's for their comfort. So we have narcissism, we have power and control. Anxiety. It's their anxiety when things are a little bit different. It is not, however, your job to fit into their box for their anxiety, all right? So we have control and power, we have narcissism, we also have anxiety. That's three of the five. Insecurity, right? Do you see how these all kind of go hand in hand? insecurity they're insecure in general if you do this maybe it's leaving them out maybe it's a change for them that they don't like so we have the insecurity pessimistic personality those are the five so they can be pessimistic everything is wrong and it also leads to passive aggressive behavior so now think about all those things and why the hell would you take anything that they say about you serious for you always about them don't take it personal